The situation in the Western Balkans is uh, very specific. First of all, there is the traditional Balkan route that continues to exist. We also have observed in the recent four or five years important changes in the way organized criminal groups are operating. For instance, have been directly going to Latin America to meet directly the producers of cocaine and to make their orders directly from the producers. Drug market in the region is extremely complex, it's dynamic, it's innovative, it's adaptable, and it requires permanent monitoring. Western Balkans partners are part of the EU enlargement uh, process. This means that they need to be prepared to work with the MCDA and other EU bodies. Today we presented uh, the final project report, which is a regional summary of the drug situation, both from health and security related areas. For the health related area, I can say that we can see some signals in the changing of drug prevalence in the region. The two main drug related findings are a possible increase in uh, use of cannabis, in particular among young people and children, and a more presence of cocaine on the regional drug market. We can draw on conclusions that we have to have even better information and better data exchange, better cooperation within the region, within the partners themselves and with the MCA. So that's why I'm quite happy to, to see that we will have a follow-up project, an IPAA project, which will continuously work on these uh, domains and in these areas to have a more transparent situation of what's happening in the region. Republic of Serbia and especially the Center of Monitoring is a part of every activities that MCDA provide to the Western Balkans countries. Of course, we couldn't do it alone. We had a big support of the MCDA through the project IPA 7. We learned how complicated our political structure is and how hard it is actually to obtain all the data and to get it from the field. So we tested several uh, options, several strategies, how to approach the uh, different stakeholders from the field in order to get uh, the available data. We still have prevention approaches which are dominating in the Western Balkan region, are still built on tradition, intuition and uh, personal observation instead of having science-based prevention. There are health issues, there are security issues, and it, in this field of security, we must exchange information for the health problems. Uh, I think it's more giving support and exchange best practices on how to deal it at a national level in these countries. It's important not to just stop here. We have to work and continue on the momentum that has been created by still increasing uh, this cooperation, by introducing novelties, like for example more insisting on the digital world and provide more support to the drug observatory uh, centers in the different countries.